this video you'll learn how to get private keys from your seed phrase, import them into MetaMask, add several seed phrases and how to work with a hardware wallet. Subscribe to the Krypton channel and let's get started. Today we'll analyze quite specific topics, but you can learn about all the basic functions of the MetaMask wallet that are necessary for everyday use by watching the first part of the MetaMask series. You can find the link to the video in the description. After creating a new wallet or importing an already existing one into MetaMask, you can create new accounts or import them using either a private key or a JSON file. By importing already existing accounts with different seed phrases, you can manage them using one MetaMask wallet. To export the private key which is already added to MetaMask, go to the account information section on your PC or request a demonstration of your private key in the corresponding security tab in the mobile app. To obtain a private key from the seed phrase, we'll use the mnemonic converter. The link will be in the description. In order to ensure security and reduce risk of getting your seed phrase and private key stolen, we'll use the offline version of the mnemonic converter and perform all actions on a computer not connected to the internet with a fresh OS. You can get access to the autonomous version of the converter by simply downloading the HTML file from the GitHub repository, the link to which you'll find in the description. After that, open the HTML file in any browser. In the BIP39 mnemonic field, enter your seed phrase and in the coin select the ethereum coin. Public and private keys will be calculated, which will be displayed just below. Each line is a separate account. In the first column, the last digit of the derivation path is the account number. The address column displays ordinary addresses that can be used to receive cryptocurrency. And in the private key column, you can see the private keys required to import the account. For example, by importing the seed phrase into MetaMask, you will get access to the first account by default. The rest of the accounts can be accessed using the MetaMask interface by clicking on create account or importing a private key, which is what we will do. For the example, we'll take the 50th account, which in fact is the 51st since the account starts from zero. You can load more accounts by entering the desired amount in the appropriate field at the bottom of the screen and by requesting the download. After copying the desired private key, go to the wallet import section on your computer or on your smartphone using the list of added wallets. Then paste the private key into the required field and click import, after which the account will be imported. If you want to use several wallets in one MetaMask extension, you can import private keys from accounts having number zero in their derivation path belonging to several seed phrases into MetaMask, thereby bypassing the wallet's prohibition to directly import more than one seed phrase. You need to keep both your private keys and seed phrase completely secure. Their loss or compromise by someone means losing all your assets. In addition to creating a new wallet or importing existing accounts and seed phrases, MetaMask has the function of connecting a hardware wallet. Currently, only Trezor and Ledger hardware wallets are available for integration. A hardware wallet in most cases is a separate device that stores private keys used to sign transactions created on third-party devices in an isolated and secure environment that is not connected to the internet. The hardware wallet is one of the most secure methods of interacting with cryptocurrency. As an example, we will show you the integration integration of the MetaMask wallet with the Trezor hardware wallet. To do this, you need to connect the wallet to your computer. Select Trezor as a wallet to connect in the MetaMask interface and export public keys to view the balance, confirming this action on the hardware wallet. Unlike importing a wallet using a seed phrase, in the next step you can choose which accounts you want to import. After importing accounts, the process of interacting with MetaMask will be the same as usual. Except that now all transactions must be signed and confirmed directly on the hardware wallet since the private keys that are required for this operation still remain isolated on the hardware wallet. For the same reason, you will not be able to export the private key of the hardware wallet account as you could with regular accounts. To import additional accounts, click on Connect Hardware hardware wallet again and select the desired accounts to import. This hardware wallet integration with MetaMask is one of the safest and most convenient ways to manage cryptocurrency assets. Keep your cryptocurrency safe and subscribe to the Krypton channel and our social media. All links will be in the description.